ライオンズ TV。Hey guys, welcome to Ryan's TV. I'm Ryan Seno. Let me introduce myself. My name is Ryan Shida. I'm a local Japanese full time YouTuber. I usually make Osaka travel guided food guide videos. So I'm at the Shima Mia right now. As you can see, it's 3 pm, but really few people there. It's kind of sad to see. In last year, there were so many people here. However, after the virus in 2020, this popular place b e c o m e like this. So today, I want to do three things. First, checking out of the biggest appliance store at the Namba station. Second, going to my friend's house by Osaka Metro train. Third, shopping at the cheapest supermarket in Japan and cooking something to eat. Hope you can enjoy a Japan life with me through this video. Usually, there are so many people in this time, but since there are not so many people, let me take a photo for the Instagram. So, hold on one second. Usually, this place because of so many people. Wi Fi remote doesn't work much, but today it works. I posted it on my Instagram, so if you haven't checked my Instagram yet, please check my Instagram too. Alright, so anyway, let's keep walking toward to Namba Station and then let's go to check the electric appliance store. So, let's go. As you can see, still, Osaka's symbol tower, Tsutenkaku Observatory, is open. Anyway, so let's keep walking. Really few people walking at the back street of Shinsekai. Speaking of the temperature today, the highest temperature is 20 degrees. Well, I heard there was snowing in Tokyo in last week. It's really weird temperature in Japan, but yes, the spring is coming. So, I'm here at Dende Town right now. As you can see, this is a bento restaurant and this is Sukiya, the gyudon restaurant. Still, many restaurants are open in Japan, but not sure when they're gonna be closed. Anyway, hope the situation will not be bad. So, the electric appliance store is the back street of Namba Station, so we have to turn left. Oh, look at that. Ah, that's pretty. Yes, actually, you know, the Sakura season is coming. However, still not that many as of today. But I believe in this weekend, it's gonna be a full of Sakura. And I'm planning to make a live stream. So please join my live stream. Well, unfortunately, the Sakura Festival is cancelled, though. Yeah, definitely last year, I didn't expect this situation. Anyway, so let's keep walking to the electric appliance store. So, the Yamada Denki, which is the Yamada appliance store, that's the place that I want to go. So, almost there. This is the entrance, so let's go. This is my favorite appliance store. I come here whenever I want to shop. I'm at the Namba Parks. From here, I'm gonna use the Osaka Metro to pick up my friend's motorbike. It takes about 30 minutes to get there. Anyway, let's keep walking. Finally arrived! Sweet! So, this is the owner of the motorbike. Go! 
Thank you. 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 Thank you
If you order it at the yakitori restaurant, it is pretty expensive, right? This much, it's only 180 Japanese yen. Ravenu. And the next, salmon sashimi. Even this one is pretty cheap, but it is really fatty, so... Oh, you know, very soft, but it's really sweet. Loving it. Well, if you only pay 300 Japanese yen for salmon, you don't expect that much quality, right? But this one is pretty good. And this is one of my favorite. It's okra. Okra is pretty healthy, right? Yeah, just put it into the soy sauce like this. Mmm. You know, it's kind of sticky like a natto. However, this one doesn't smell like a natto, so it's pretty good. And again, it perfectly matches with beer. Ah, psycho. It's eggplant. This eggplant perfectly matches with karashi, which is a Japanese mustard. So, just use like this and... Mmm! It is sour and spicy. But it's good. <laughs> you know, tastes like a Japanese pickle, but this one has a bit of plum flavor. This is the happiest moment. You know, if you eat like this at the outside, it could be 1,500 Japanese yen to 2,000 Japanese yen in izakaya. But if you just go to the super tamade, cook it a little bit, then you can eat it with really cheap price. Ah, ah, loving it. Speaking of the situation in Japan, you know, because of the virus, we are pretty much locked down. This channel is mainly going outside and explaining and showing the hidden spot, right? However, in this kind of situation, it's really hard to shoot the video. But today, I could rent the motorbike from my friend so I can go to the travel spot without public transportation. I'm gonna show you guys how the Japan situation looks like right now. I'm gonna make a live stream too. So please look forward to it. Anyway, in this weekend, I'm planning to make a Sakura walking live stream. So hope you can join that. Look at this block of salmon. This one must be fatty and really tasty. Well, one good news for me was Olympic was postponed. You know, if they have Olympic right now, no one can come over to Japan, right? That would be disaster. One of the reasons I started my YouTube channel is because of the Olympic. But if the Olympic not gonna come, then I'm gonna be like... <laughs> it will be so sad. Yeah, so hopefully situation gets better soon and people can travel to Japan with peace. Alright, so hope you like my vlog style video. Don't worry about it, I'm gonna make a travel guide and also a virus situation update videos and a live stream too. So please look forward to it. So this video pretty much that's it. Please subscribe to my channel and please turn on your notification if you haven't. And please check my Instagram and Twitters. Stay safe. Arigato. So, bye-bye.